Welcome to the toolbox talk of hand tools. A hand tool is any tool that is powered by hand rather than a motor. Hammers, wrenches, chisels, pliers, screwdrivers, and other hand tools are often underrated as sources of potential danger. Hand tools may look harmless, but they are the cause of many injuries. In fact, an estimated 8% of a workplace, compensable injuries are caused by incidents associated with hand tools. These injuries can be serious, including loss of fingers or eyesight. Let's discuss about the major injuries caused by hand tools. The first is cuts, abrasions, amputations, and punctures. If hand tools are designed to cut or move metal and wood, remember what a single slip can do to fragile human flesh. Eye injuries. Flying chips of wood or metal are a common hazard, often causing needless and permanent blindness. Repetitive motion injuries. Using the same tool, in the same way, all day long, day after day, can stress human muscles and ligaments. Injury from continuous vibration can also cause numbness or poor circulation in hands and arms. Broken bones and bruises. Tools can slip, fall from heights, or even be thrown by careless employees, causing severe injuries. Now, let's talk about the safe practices, one by one. Use the right tool for the job. Don't use your wrench as a hammer. Don't use a screwdriver as a chisel, etc. Don't use broken or damaged tools, dull cutting tools, or screwdrivers with worn tips. The wooden handles of tools shall be kept free of splinters or cracks and shall be kept tight inside the tool. Carry tools securely in a tool belt or box. Don't carry tools up ladders, use a hoist or rope. Keep close track of tools when working at heights. A falling tool can kill a co-worker. Pass a tool to another person by the handle. Never toss it to them. Use the right personal protective equipment for the job. Never carry sharp or pointed tools, such as a screwdriver, in your pocket. Select ergonomic tools for your work task when movements are repetitive and forceful. Be on the lookout for signs of repetitive stress. Early detection might prevent a serious injury. Always keep your tools in top condition. A dull blade or blunt point can lead to injury. Make sure your grip and footing are secure when using large tools. Store tools properly when you are done using them. With this, let's complete our toolbox talk on hand tools. Have a safe day.